Guys, my name is Gavin or GDS, and today I'm going to be going over my main speed cubes as of May 2020. So this video is basically just, I don't know, I'm just basically showing you all the events that I've been practicing lately, and what I currently average on them, and like what my mains are, so yeah. So starting off with 2x2, two two, I'm going to move this over. I'm using this Vulk 2M, and yeah, so okay, let me move the camera up. I'm using this Vulk 2M. Uh, really nothing much to say about it. It is a little bit sluggish, but it's very stable and smooth and pretty fast. And if you set it up correctly, it can become really nicely. So, uh, currently I use, um, I'm kind of trash at 2x2. Two two. I know, like, maybe 10 CLLs right now, but I don't really know many CLLs, really. And I'm mainly using, like, LBL and Ortega. But I do average, like, sub... 3.2 something like that so like low three to high twos something like that and you know sub two singles aren't that rare for me anymore and i'd have like a few sub one singles as well so yeah that's for two by two all right so for three by three and oh i'm using this Vulk three elite m so this cube is honestly really nice and stable i'm really enjoying the feeling of it right now and you know, I'm just really liking it so far. Um, really, this 3x3 three three is currently, I think, probably my best event right now. As of speaking, I really don't know. It's not my main event or not my favorite event, but for 3x3, three three, I basically just use CFOP. I don't use, like, any ZBLLs or anything like that. Just straight CFOP, and that's really it. Um, and I average about, like, 9 to 10 seconds on average. Sometimes I can get a few, like, 7s and 8s and... You know, sometimes I might average a little slower, like 11, but that's really it for 3x3. Three three. And one-handed um, is completely different, because I'm, I'm okay at one-handed. I'm not the best. I am a righty. So, I saw like this. But, um, for one-handed, I average about low 20, like... I'd say, like, 21-ish, like, 20 to 21, depending, like, what I average. Sub-20 isn't really that hard for me, but I'm not good at getting a lot of sub-20 averages because I'm really inconsistent on OH, so, yeah. But I, I use um, the Valk Elite for both 3 and OH, so, yep. Um, 4x4, four four, I'm using this little matchup M. Uh, for 4x4, four four, uh, I'm not really good at big cubes at all um i average like sub 55 um so yeah like i average about like 52 to 53 on average sub 50 single isn't really that bad for me but most of the time i'm not really doing well on 4x4 it hasn't been really fun for me as much lately because i haven't been really practicing big cubes as much as i feel like i should but I'm just not really, like, a big cube person, you know? It's, like, because most people that average, like, the same on me on, like, 3x3 three three average, like, really close to sub-40. So, yeah, I, I learned big cubes really late. So, that's, like, the main reason why I'm really slow. But, yeah, 4x4, four four, I use the Yushin Little Magic. And for 5x5, five five, I also use the Little Magic. Um, I don't know. I, I'm just not really good at big cubes, as I already said. Uh, I average, like, low twos, so, like, 205, something like that, like, sub-205. Um, I have, I think, I have I have a couple sub-two singles, I mean, sub-two averages, and I do have, uh, I think I might have, like, two or three sub-150 singles, so. And then I also have, like, a sub-140 single as well. But, you know, 5x5 five five isn't really the best event, in my opinion. I'm not really enjoying it as much as I used to. Again, I'm just not really a big cube person at all, so, yeah. Alright, so for Mega Minx, I'm using this Chi Hang. Because, you know, I'm not really good at Mega Minx, but... I've been actually starting to get more into it lately, so that's why I put it on the list. But, you know, I average about sub 240-ish. and Like, maybe like sub 230 if I get lucky, but... I don't know. I'm not the best at Mega Minx, and... You know, it's just an event that's kind of fun to do. Hopefully, I can update this cube as well. And then lastly, we saved the best cube for last, square one. I use this Yushin Little Magic M. 
Um, really nice cube for under 10 bucks, and I mean, like, it's magnetic as well. Um, this one's probably set up pretty nicely. I mean, Score 1 is my main event, so, yeah, I have been enjoying it lately. Um, for a Square 1, I average about, maybe, low, like, around, like, what I do with OH, but I do get a lot of, like, sub-20 singles. They're not really, like, rare for me anymore. I average about sub-21 to maybe sub-20, somewhere around there. Um, I really don't know, but, yeah, hopefully I can get past the sub-20 mark very soon. But, yeah, that's basically it for Squan, but, yeah, that's really it, so, uh, thank you guys for watching my video, and I just also want to say something really quick, the reason why I have not been, like, uploading this past week at all was because I'm actually kind of sick right now, um, uh, so I haven't really been doing cubing much or stacking much. I have been doing some of it here and there, but, you know, I'm just, I'm a little sick, but I mean, it's not like corona or anything, so that's good, but yeah, that's basically it, so, um, you might be seeing videos more from me next week, I have a couple that I already filmed that I, or from like last week that I just didn't upload, so next week, or by the end of this week, you might be seeing more videos from me, but yeah, that's really it for the video. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.